بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم صلاة والسلام على رسولنا محمد سيد الأول والآخر مدد يا رسول مدد يا سادة أصحاب رسول الله مدد يا مشايخنا الدستور مولانا شاب الله فارس داسان شاب محمد عادل محقال مدد تاريخاتنا الصحبة والخير في الجميع بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم وما يرضى عندك ربي يسكوى بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم ومن يعرض عن ذكر ربه يسلك عذاب صعدا ومن أعرض عن ذكري فأنا لهم معيشة ضنكا ونحشر يوم القيامة أعمى It's an ayah of the Holy Quran عظيم الشأن I could not remember it We could not remember it exactly at the moment Whoever turns his face away from Allah He will go through hardship and troubles Says Allah Azza wa Jalla Whoever gives up gives up the dhikr, remembrance of Allah, and doesn't remember Allah will have a troubled life. And on the day of judgment he will be he will rise as blind. The condition of the world now is such that everywhere there is trouble. People think that they have troubles only in the place they live in. Other places have much worse troubles. If people stop to think why those troubles occur, it is because they are turning their faces away from Allah Azza They are rebelling against Him. Therefore, He makes life troubled and hard in this world. And they will rise as blind in the hereafter, in Akhirah. People will say and ask, Why am I blind now? I wasn't blind in the world. Allah Azza will reply then, You did not remember me in the world, in dunya. You had rebelled. That is why you are blind. They will be raised with more troubles. The day of judgment, the day of resurrection is a tough day. May Allah protect us from its hardship. Son of man, mankind cannot bear little hardship in this world. Yet the hardship of the judgment lasts for years. Sometimes for hundreds of years, sometimes for thousands of years. Do people stay in that judgment? May Allah protect us. Those who are the people who think that they are clever in this world, who rebel against Allah and don't accept Him. People who don't accept His way have hardship both in this world, in dunya, and hardship a thousand times worse in the hereafter, in akhirah. Because eternal life is an akhirah now, and this life will pass and be over. In order to be saved from this life, either some people put an end to it by themselves, or Allah does it, as everything has an end in this life, no matter how long a person lives, compared to the life of the hereafter, of Akhirah, the life we are living in is not even as, sh- as short as the blink of an eye. Therefore, in order to not to put our life here and hereafter in hardship, in difficulty, we should obey. We should obey Allah Azza wa Jalla. We should appreciate the favors Allah Azza wa Jalla gives us and be grateful. Give thanks so that these troubles are gone. The whole world, as we said, is in trouble now. People are rebelling more and more and are not turning to Allah. They're turning to dunya. They're striving to do things according to their minds. So these troubles are going on. Therefore, these troubles are going on. The prescription for the sick is clear, but people are not accepting it. Those who accept it will be saved. 
Those who don't accept it will be in trouble. May Allah protect us. May Allah let us live in comfort here and hereafter with His grace and kindness, with His fadl and karam, inshallah.